Good afternoon, my good people. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, whereby we always give you education of bangers each and every day. Let me start by appreciating you people for the support you have given me so far, because it's all because of you that this channel is where it is at the moment. I can't forget to comment or to congratulate the community at large, because I I, I, I do appreciate the comments, the appreciation the community is giving towards this channel. So, if you are, you are there and you have not subscribed, what are you waiting? And if you have, it's your first time to watch this channel, just take a second or two, hit the subscription button, Put the notification bell on so that whenever I produce a video like this, YouTube will automatically notify you and will never miss any of, of our uh, educational bangers. In our previous video, we were looking on how back control pills help in preventing uh, conception. Oh, how birth control pills work the first point was that it works by prevention of ovulation or preventing ovulation ovulation is whereby a female egg is produced from the ovum then it travels to the fallopian tubes where it meets with the sperm or the male sperm and after they met they come and implant in the uterus so, prevention of ovulation. Each month, your ovaries release a mature egg from ovaries. Each month, your ovaries release a mature egg from your ovaries. This is called ovulation. So, so the release of a mature egg from the ovum it's what we are talking about and it's what is called ovulation. If this egg comes into contact with sperm, you become pregnant. If there is no egg for fertilization, pregnancy is impossible. Let me repeat this again. Prevention of ovulation. Each month your ovaries release a mature egg from your ovaries. This is called ovulation. If this egg comes into contact with sperm, you become pregnant. If there is no egg for fertil for, for, to fertilize, pregnancy is impossible. What does this mean? For pregnancy to occur, the male and the female The female ovum and the male sperm have to meet at a point. So, when you are using these birth control pills, they prevent ovulation. How? Oh, how do they help to prevent unwanted pregnancies? The first point we have said, I'm just repeating for the case of those who are joining or those who are left behind. Prevention of ovulation is one of the methods in which birth control pills prevent unwanted pregnancies. Each month, your ovaries release a mature egg from your ovaries. Each month, your ovaries release a mature egg from your ovaries. This is called ovulation. If this egg comes into contact with sperm, you become pregnant. If there is no egg to fertilize, pregnancy is not possible. The second way in which birth control pills prevent unwanted pregnancies is by increasing the amount of mucus. Increasing the amount of mucus. The hormones found in birth control pills increase the buildup of 
sticky mucus on your cervix, increasing the amount of mucus. The hormones found in birth control pills increase the buildup of sticky mucus on your cervix. This buildup makes it harder for sperm to enter the cervix. If the sperm are not able to enter the cervix, they can fertilize an egg if one is released. Let me repeat this again. They prevent unwanted pregnancies by increasing the amount of mucus. The hormones found in birth control pills increase the buildup of sticky mucus on your cervix. This buildup makes it harder for sperm to enter the cervix. If the sperm are not are unable to enter the cervix, they can fertilize an egg. They can fertilize an egg if one is released. The third way in which birth control pills help in preventing um, unwanted pregnancies is by thinning the uterine lining. Thinning the uterine lining. The lining of your uterus is also altered after a few months. The lining of your uterus is also altered. After a few months, your uterus after a few months, sorry, of using the pills, your uterine lining may be so thin that a fertilized egg would have a difficulty in attaching to it or implanting. Thinning the uterine lining. The lining of the of your uterus is also altered. This is how we are still discussing how these birth control pills prevent unwanted pregnancies and we are at the third point which is thinning the uterine lining. The lining of your uterus is also altered. After a few months, the lining of your uterus is also altered. After a few months of using the pills, your uterine lining may also be thin your uterine lining may also may, may also be thin that a fertilized egg would have a difficulty attaching to it. If an egg can attach to the uterus, it can begin development. So this egg or this ovum or this fertilized egg has to attach or implant itself in the uterus for any development to start. That's why we are saying, if an egg can't attach to the uterus, it can't begin development. A thinner uterine lining may also affect the bleeding you experience during menstruation. I hope we are together up to this third point. A thinner uterine lining may also affect the bleeding you experience during menstruation. Without a thick uterine lining to shed, your periods may be lighter. A thinner uterine lining may also affect the bleeding you experience during menstruation. Without a thick uterine lining to shed, your periods may be lighter. Eventually, you may not experience any bleeding at all. A thinner uterine lining may also affect the bleeding you experience during menstruation. And without a thick uterine lining to shed your periods, to shed your periods may be lighter. Eventually, you may not experience any bleeding at all. A point to note. Birth control pills are more than 99% effective at preventing an unplanned pregnancy. A point to note, birth control pills are more than 99% effective at preventing unplanned pregnancy if taken properly. 
the key point here is if taken properly. There are some types of birth control that have similar results and this include the ring, the patch and the shot. There are some types of birth control uh, taken that have similar results and this include the ring, the patch and the shot. How the hormones affect your body? How the hormones affect your body? Birth control pills contain hormones and these hormones are estrogen and progesterone and are synthetic forms of hormones that naturally occur in your body. How the hormones affect your body? Birth control pills contain hormones hormones and these hormones estrogen and progesterone are synthetic forms of hormones that naturally occur in your body in our next video we will continue with this discussion because it's a long one and thank you for being with me thank you for subscribing liking and sharing my videos so let's continue supporting this channel to greater heights have a wonderful day ahead